Hi viewers, welcome to the swing trading video. In the previous video, we have uh, explained you what is swing trading, and as promised, we are uh, will be discussing here the stock selection process for a swing traders. Myself, Rajesh Bhatia, senior research analyst and editor at Equity Masters. So. What is uh, swing trading we have covered now coming on to the stock selection process. So three important parameters on stock selection process. First, you should define your strategy, uh, be it technical, be it derivatives. Uh, and as I said, it fundamental is uh, not a part of uh, swing trading because generally fundamentals are uh, uh, probably three months, six months, one year trade or probably more than that. But when it comes to the swing trading, uh, one week, one day to two weeks, probably uh, technical plays very well over here. So you have to define your stock selection process. Uh, first is define strategy. Uh, I'll just throw some light on define strategy as well. So uh, first have to select what type of charts you want. So there you have various types of charts available with you. Uh, so first is, uh, as I said, candlesticks, uh, Hekenashi, Kagi, point and figure. So there are various uh, uh, chart type of charts on plater for you. So you have to select the best one. Uh, again, price action, uh, what kind of price action you want. Uh, we want to play a uh, price trading about the X days highs, X days lows or price about closing about the X days high, X days lows, indicating the breakouts. Uh, third is moving average. So this is generally a well known uh, swing trading uh, indicators or the moving average which most of the people use so you can choose uh, various moving averages so i generally uh, choose the short term averages and in next video i'll be sharing my couple of strategies for you uh, on stock selection process purely from swing trading point of view now you have coming on the moving average you have various uh, sms which is simple moving average you have ems exponential moving average you have weighted moving, uh, moving average so do check out what suits you uh, check out what are the advantage and disadvantage for uh, three averages SMA, EMA and uh, WMA. Then coming on to the next oscillators. So uh, selecting an oscillator is also uh, very important. So in our previous video we have uh, clearly defined uh, on how and also we explained the strategy of uh, the averages how they play out and uh, how can you choose that uh, uh, averages and oscillators. So do watch that video as well. So coming on to the oscillators over here, you can choose from uh, RSI, you can choose from MACD, Stochastics, ADX. So there are various uh, technical parameters you can try out uh, before uh, defining your strategies and also do backtesting. So in previous video also we have covered the backtesting uh, results, how they pose up. So there are various software also available where we have covered video on softwares as well. So these are the series we are covering everything right a traders need. So whatever a trader is planning to do a full time trading, uh, this video series will uh, help you out to do each and every stuffs. So after you have defined your strategy, you have to select the baskets, what kind of stocks you want. So probably if you want uh, only a large caps to play nifty 50 or nifty 100, whatever you want. Uh, in case you want a bigger universe of small cap, large caps and mid caps, you can select nifty 500 stocks. Probably you can select mid cap stock, you can select small cap stocks. Uh, those who want to look for FNOs, uh, you can look for FNO stocks who want to play in futures, who want to play in options. Uh, they can filter down more from FNO stocks with liquid options volume. Uh, so if I just look at as of now, we have around 140, 547 FNO stocks uh, in uh, NSC which, uh, which are traded. Out of that, if I just draw down, come down to the filter down to the options uh, with liquid volume, we might turn out to be around 25, 30 or probably 40 not more than that so you have to choose that uh, options uh, volumes when you are drawing down to the option strategies so and uh, again uh, if you want to look for all stocks which are around 3000 4000 stocks and filter it out you can do that as well or you can create your custom uh, basket where you want 50 stocks 30 stocks or 10 stocks 15 stocks to be traded and look keep a watch on that so you can do that as well so now uh, when you are defined a strategy, you have defined your uh, basket of stocks. The final comes to the filtration of stocks. So when you scan your strategies, uh, 
so there may be n number of stocks uh, uh, in from your basket so you have to choose the filter one so best one uh, you have to or either you can do the rating system as well uh, so depending upon the rating system as i said uh, if you want uh, a price going about 20 days high and uh, xyz moving average is giving a positive growth so you can rate uh 30 percent to the price going about 20 days high 30 40 percent to the moving averages crossover uh 20 percent to probably the oscillators or if you're in a couple of other so you can divide the percentage in those and you create a ranking system as well so that the filtration process is more easier for you so that's the way you can do the stock selection process for uh, uh swing trading thank you do not forget to subscribe to my email newsletters fast profits daily and get a free guide on how to trade markets like pro thank you